Former Los Angeles County Board Supervisor, trailblazing politician, and activist, Gloria Molina has passed away at the age of 74. She had been battling terminal cancer for the last three years, and on March 14th, Gloria announced she was entering a transition in life. Gloria broke many barriers as the first Latina elected to the California Legislature, LA City Council, and the LA County Board of Supervisors. Molina is celebrated for advocating for effective government reforms, tending to the county's public health care system, and environmental change. Mayor Bass stated, she shaped Los Angeles in a lasting way while paving the way for future generations of leaders. I express my deepest condolences. Gloria passed away at her home in Mount Washington, surrounded by family, and a public celebration of her life is planned at La Plaza in the near future. Since taking office, LA Mayor Karen Bass declared a statewide emergency on homelessness and signed three executive directives to confront the issue. Upon review, the mayor wrote a letter to colleagues and Angelinos recommending a bolder approach to identify and quickly use city-owned resources. A new program exploring innovative ways to increase affordable housing development on publicly owned land starts in the new fiscal year, July 1, 2023. In partnership with Governor Gavin Newsom, site development of up to 500 interim housing units called emergency sleeping cabins is currently underway. For more information on the land proposal and the work of the mayor's office, visit mayor.lacity.gov. The Department of Cultural Affairs, DCA, has been selected to receive a $20,000 NEA National Endowment for the Arts Big Read Grant. DCA is one of 62 organizations in the nation selected for the grant that will assist a reading program of Charles Yu's book, Interior Chinatown. The NEA Big Read, which is an initiative in partnership with Arts Midwest, brings shared reading to help expand our knowledge of the world. The DCA also received $25,000 from Sony Pictures Entertainment for Angelinos to enjoy art projects, reading parties, workshops, and more. In addition to the reading of the book, Interior Chinatown, there will also be a reading of Jean Luen Yang's book, American Born Chinese. For more info, visit culturela.org.